Hello, thank you for watching the channel. Thank you for joining me today. My name is Tawana. I'm clairvoyant and I'm going to be doing Leo. If you guys are trying to get a reading done by me, just text my phone, you guys. My information is down below. Don't forget to subscribe and like the video and everything. And yeah, everything you need to know about me is down there. My website, if you guys want to see what's on my website, and uh, you can watch this for any place. Man. And what I'm seeing right now, look, some of y'all not trying to feel some emotions right now. Some of y'all are just all cut off from this shit. You're just ready to move away from something. Okay, some of you could have water in your chart, or you may be dealing with Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio energy. There is a very controlling motherfucker here, okay? I'm going to just have to call him a motherfucker. I'm sorry. But whoever this is, I feel like you might have a conversation with somebody and they're being very controlling, okay? Or somebody might tell you that you are controlling, okay? I see it going either way. So, I feel like somebody is stingy with their money right now. They don't want to spend a dime of it. Could be you or somebody else. I also feel that some of you are ready to just end something. You just like you you just ready. You you know it's like you're trying to bring the tower yourself, okay? You you pretty much saying this shit is fucking ending to today. To fucking day. Okay, I hear somebody saying. So pretty much some of you might remember when you had a tower before or you're just thinking about bringing this tower, okay? So I see some of you ready to start new things. Some of y'all could be, you know, meeting up with people. Uh, you might be checking your emails a lot. Uh, you may be talking about business, training, transactions, contracts around this time. I see a lot of communication, okay? I also see an ending. So somebody's going to end it, Okay. Whatever you're ending, it has something to do with your motherfucking past, honey. It has something to do with Gemini, Libra, Aquarius energy. And some of you are just like, fuck this shit, okay? Some of y'all didn't got fucking bored, okay? Some of y'all got bored with somebody, and you are so fucking impatient right now, okay? So I feel like right now, don't worry about what's going on right now, Leo. Just let everything fall into place, because the universe got your motherfucking back on whatever this is. I feel... Like something needed to end so you can move forward. So I feel like you need to be patient. Be motherfucking patient because, honey, something is changing. For a long time, some of y'all were settling for something. It could have been separation. You could have been away from somebody for a very long time or something. Uh, some of y'all could have got divorces or something. Some of y'all could have been separated from a twin flame. I'm seeing Gemini energy here. I'm seeing Pisces energy here. I'm seeing Taurus, Aries, Sagittarius. I'm seeing a lot of energy here. So I feel like some of you were settling for something that was just no good. But I feel that somebody is coming in, okay? And I feel like you could be showing somebody love right now or they're showing you love. I'm seeing watery energy here. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. I'm also seeing somebody with trust issues. Could be you or somebody else, okay? And again, that water energy is coming up. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio energy. Somebody is jealous, insecure, you know, or they might be an alcoholic. They might be a stalker. They might be someone always blaming you for the shit they doing. You know, they always trying to act like they didn't do nothing. And, you know, I see a lot of energy like that. Somebody is a manipulator in this situation. Either it's you or somebody else. That's the way I'm seeing it. Somebody is... <laughs> Somebody acting like they ain't do shit. Like, I ain't do shit. I ain't do shit. That's what I'm hearing. You just, some of y'all might have just ran out of ideas, ran out of options, or you just feeling like motherfuckers have been lying to you for the longest. Okay? I do know for sure that somebody with water placements has lied to you. I'm going to tell you that for sure. There is burdens here, I feel. Look, some of y'all got the Ten of Wands here, okay? This is baggage, burdens, whatever the hell you want to call it. You're working yourself too much here, Leo. I also see the world part here. So some of you could be, you know, 
traveling, you could be changing your residence, or you may be talking to someone that's a distance from you. Um, and I see balance coming your way. Look, Six of Pentacles, the balance card is here. I fucking love it, okay? Somebody could be giving you a gift, or you're giving somebody else a gift. I also see Nine of Pentacles. This is looking good, too. Okay, when this money comes, definitely enjoy this money, Leo. This is this is definitely coming your way. Um, I see you making a decision. Some of y'all making a decision about somebody, okay? Let's see what this is about. And also, I feel like some of you may not want to commit to a situation as well, okay? And this is why you are moving forward. I feel like you needed to plan something out. But now that you have a plan, you're saying that there's something in your life that you don't want to commit to, okay? And somebody keeps asking you a lot of questions, okay? Because somebody's spying on you, okay? Somebody wants to know what you're doing behind closed doors. This is a Gemini, the Aquarius person. I can't stand to see them little motherfucking jealous bitches in a reading. Somebody's a jealous bitch, a fucking hater in this damn reading. Somebody just got bored. You know what I mean? It could have been you getting bored or somebody else getting bored. But somebody said, this is this is not my life. I can't do this kind of shit. I want to do something fun. You know, and Leo, I know you want to have fun. You know what I mean? So if you're not having fun in your life right now, this is a, this is pretty much letting you know that you needed to get out of this shit. Because I already see the tower coming. All right. And like I said, some of y'all could have brought on your own fucking tower. <laughs> shit. You said shit. Let me get rid of this shit real quick. I'm done, bitch. <laughs> Let me see. Okay, look, you got justice too. See, you know what you're doing. You made the right motherfucking moves. You made the fucking right moves. You might have took a little bit of losses or something, or you might have got manipulated a little bit, but you still made the right moves. Because I see y'all taking losses. Because this bitch right here, this motherfucker was watching you too heavy, okay? This is the motherfucker that was talking about you behind your motherfucking back, okay? And as a page, this could have been a child. It could have been your neighbors. It could have been your motherfucking ex. There's somebody that's jealous as fuck of your situation, okay? And I feel like they want to see you fail. They want to see you motherfucker fail. And look, whoever's manipulating you has a lot of motherfucking secrets too. It could be a Gemini for some of you. It could be a Pisces. But whatever it is, that situation was full of lies, deceit. You know, and I always see that energy as somebody that was a habitual motherfucking liar. Okay? So, you're all about committing, okay, to something different. It could be a new job. It could be you know, a person, it could be, you know, messages, you know, you want to take somebody, you want to call them, it could be some shit like that. Some of y'all could be dealing with somebody that has uh, Taurus energy, or you could have Taurus energy, okay? But whatever, whatever is going on, I feel like you have opened up yourself to people. You have show, shown them like your true self, Okay. And it's like, what else, do, what, what else do you want from me? I feel like somebody wants everything from you. I feel like they want your money. They want your fucking soul. They want to fucking use you for the rest of their motherfucking life. That's what I feel like somebody wants from you, okay? And some of you might have been going through some struggles of your own, money problems and stuff. And you don't need no extra motherfucking baggage of somebody trying to get you to, you know... Get them every motherfucking thing. Somebody was trying to fucking use Leo too. I feel like it's somebody with earth energy. Let me see. Some of y'all are just, you know, making a solid decision to keep your money in your motherfucking pocket so you can save it the best way you can, okay? And I feel like some of you are holding on to some text messages, okay? You may be keeping this shit in your phone. So you can look back at it, okay? I also feel that some of y'all taking a break. You like fuck this shit. You wanna take a motherfucking break and plan some old shit. You want you you ready to isolate, okay? Some of y'all might have been dealing with a Virgo, okay? Maybe you don't want to deal with that bitch anymore or something. But whatever it is, listen. This is somebody's reading here. I can just feel that this is a somebody's fucking reading. What's going on? Because you, there's going to be a lot of planning that take place, a lot of solitude. 
I'm picking up here with Leo, okay? I'm really getting this for Leo Risings, definitely. But it could be any Leo placements that's going through this. Let me do the last spread here. Leo, 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 Leo. See? Still getting the motherfucking hermit. Somebody might have been dealing with somebody with Virgo placements, or maybe you have Virgo placements. You're showing up as the motherfucking empress here, okay? This is your energy today, okay? Grounded, you know? And if you don't feel that way, honey, is going to come, okay? Some of y'all have earth energy people coming towards you or air energy people coming towards you, okay? If it's an earth sign or an air sign, I feel like that person may be grounded, okay? If it's a Taurus or Libra. But I also see somebody with earth energy coming towards you and... They might, they might be bisexual. I'm seeing bisexual energy here too. You know, so some of y'all might know somebody that's bisexual. I also pick up that somebody might be coming towards you, but they bringing somebody with their ass, okay? It could be another earth sign, okay? Capricorn towards Virgo. Also see, like, somebody may be in a situation where somebody is grounded and the other person ain't got their shit together, okay? So... I feel like somebody didn't feel like they were in a power couple. They felt like somebody else was lacking while they was, you know, doing well, okay? And I just see you looking at all the shit you accomplished in life. You just like, or all that shit, that, all the work you put in, and you just like, damn, look at, look at this shit, okay? And some of you are just ready to move. You don't even want to live where you're living. You're uncomfortable in your home. You're spending more time outside, probably going, driving around, sitting you know, sitting at the park or going outside the house somewhere, okay? Or some of y'all separated from a twin flame or you're just in a situation where you might have had a marriage that failed or something or something just crumbled, it fell apart, okay? But I feel like whatever this is, I feel like... I feel like some of y'all could have got ghosted, okay? I see somebody getting ghosted and I also feel like somebody just... Somebody just felt like they didn't have any faith anymore. You're like, I don't fucking have any faith in this shit anymore. I'm fucking turning my back on this. I'm not waiting on this fucking son of a bitch anymore. You know what I mean? And it's ending in a heartbreak. You know what I mean? Somebody's going to fucking separate, go through a breakup or something, heartbreak, tears and shit. And then there's conflict here with the five of wands, okay? Who is that? Leo, Sag, Aries energy. It could be you starting fights or something. Or some of you probably was dealing with somebody that had air placements. That was a son of a bitch, okay? So I feel like something had to end, okay? It's ended with the Ten of Cups reverse. This could be a family member. This could be a relationship, marriage, whatever it is. But I feel like somebody went through a fucking lot, okay? Somebody went through a fucking lot. And they are not getting along with somebody. And somebody's family is fucking totally dysfunctional. That's what I'm hearing. Let me look at the class and session cards. This is my friend's cards. She has a channel called Class and Session. You can find her online if you want to purchase her cards. All right, let me do right here. All right, so what I have here, communication is definitely in reverse. So you may not be talking to nobody at this time. We got je jealous in reverse. So I feel like I don't see you jealous in the situation at all, okay? We got commitment. Some of you have a commitment coming towards you. And I have a card that says, I ruined their lives. So, somebody feel like they ruined somebody's life, okay? Um, we also have Dark Night of the Soul, but it's in reverse. So, I don't see anybody having a dark night. I see power here. So, somebody could be getting their power back. And I also have Intuition. So, somebody is very intuitive in this situation. Could be you or somebody else. And I'm just... Feeling like somebody somebody knows what the fuck is going on. Somebody probably felt like they did, you know, but, you know, never doubt your intuition. Okay, definitely. 
All right, so that's all I have for Leo. I hope I helped you out there, okay? I'm going to get this video up, and then I'm going to tap into Sagittarius because we need to see what's going on with Sagittarius. I'm a Sagittarius, so I got to get my video up.